Welcome to Prissy Anto Educational Academy. In this session, I am going to explain you the moment generating function that is MGF mean and variance of exponential distribution. Let us see how to find the exponential distribution. The definition of exponential distribution is f of x which is equal to lambda into e power minus lambda x e x is greater than 0 so this is exponential distribution formula so mgf is moment generating function which is equal to that is denoted by mx of t which is equal to integral because this is a exponential distribution is continuous distribution e power tx into f of x into dx this is the formula which is equal to the limit is x is greater than 0 so therefore you have to take 0 to infinity e power tx f of x is exponential distribution lambda e power minus lambda x into dx which is equal to lambda is a common so you can take uh, e power minus of lambda minus t into x into dx integral e power ax which is equal to into dx is equal to e power ax divided by a this is the formula so using this lambda into e power minus of lambda minus t into x divided by minus of lambda minus t the limit is 0 to infinity when you apply the upper limit the value is e power minus infinity so therefore 0 minus for x 0 you have to apply lower limit e power 0 will be 1 so 1 divided by minus of lambda minus t 1 divided by minus of lambda minus t so minus minus plus so lambda divided by lambda minus t so moment generating function is lambda divided by lambda minus t so this is a very important this is called as moment generating function so next the mean so you can find the mean variance this can be written moment generating function can be written as lambda divided by lambda minus t this can be written lambda if you are taking in the denominator lambda as a common 1 minus t divided by lambda which is equal to lambda lambda cancel 1 divided by 1 minus t by lambda which is equal to 1 minus t by lambda whole inverse so you know very well 1 minus x whole inverse this is the formula 1 plus x plus x square plus x cube plus etc so using this uh, formula this is a formula so using this formula 1 minus t divided by lambda whole inverse which is equal to 1 plus t divided by lambda plus t square divided by lambda square plus t cube divided by lambda cube plus etc so therefore mu 1 dash which is equal to e of x expectation of x which is equal to the coefficient of the coefficient of t divided by 1 factorial so therefore the coefficient of t divided by 1 factorial can be written 1 by lambda e of x is equal to 1 by lambda e of x square which is equal to the coefficient of coefficient of t by t square by 2 factorial coefficient of t square by 
2 factorial t square is there but 2 factorial is not there so therefore you have to multiply in the numerator by 2 so what is the t square t square divided by lambda square so 2 if you multiply here also you have to multiply so t square divided by 2 which is equal to 2 by lambda square so which is equal to 2 divided by right lambda square this is e of x square expectation of x square variance of x you know very well e of x square this is one of the method another method is there to find the mean variance which is equal to 2 by lambda square minus 1 by lambda square which is equal to 1 by lambda square this is the variance